Hello, everyone. And um, thanks to Chris. Sorry, I've just got this meeting, this sign on my screen. Um, OK, yeah, so thanks, Chris, Chris Harrison, for being with me today from S Mindset SFT Hypnosis. You'll get it one week. There I we always go. get it one week. <laughs> this week, we have decided to demonstrate how we do su suggestibility tests. We, we both do them slightly differently. and. Um, you're, you will find that, that, that these will be targeted to you. So, for example, I would I would give give you a, a session to start off with where we talk about your goals and what you want to change and um, your intention for engaging in the hypnosis. And um, but in order to kind of relax you in and just to find out where you are in the scheme of things in terms of how susceptible you are to hypnosis, we'll do some little suggestibility tests. And so this is what we're going to demonstrate for you today. So, Chris, are you ready to go into hypnosis? Yep. Are you sitting comfortably and safely? I am, yep. Ecology is my top priority. So, okay. To get hypnotised, it's really about the movement of the eyes. So you look up, look up, keep your eyes up, and just close your eyes. So that's right. So again, eyes open wide and look up. And look up. Imagine you're trying to look into your eyebrows. Keep them like that and keep your eyes like that and close the lids down. So open your eyes wide open. Look up as high as you can and keep your eyes glued up. And just breathe in and breathe out. And every time you blink, deep, deep, powerful hypnosis is already coming upon you. Keep your eyes up, breathe in, breathe out. The more you blink, the faster, deeper you're going into hypnosis. Just one more time, breathe in, hold it, keep your eyeballs up. But this time, as you exhale, Keep your eyeballs up and close your eyelids right down. As your eyelids shut down, the muscles have already become heavy, droopy, drowsy. Your eyes are already feeling lock tight, lock shut. But I want you to forget all about the position of your eyes. I want you to drop your chin down a bit. So you get that looking down feeling. It's as if you're looking down a flight of stairs. And as I count, you're going to see your feet and hear your feet and even feel your feet connecting on every step. And you go deeper, deeper, deeper all the time. You're looking down 10 steps and you're moving on to step 10. You're taking step nine, going deeper. You're taking step eight each muscle is letting loose and you're going deeper you're taking step seven you can see your feet hear your feet feel your feet touching each step as you go deeper 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 you're taking step six and five going way down deeper 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 you're taking step four going even deeper and now step three as each muscle as every muscle every nerve goes deeper 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 you're taking step two and one just go deeper 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 and as you go deeper you're listening perfectly exactly the way you are and I just want you to feel that wave of relaxation going from the tip of your head right the way through your body down to the tips of your toes and now Chris I want you to stretch your arms out as if you're holding the handlebars of a bike that's right and in your left hand, you're holding an enormous red fire bucket that's filled with heavy, wet sand. And straight away, you can feel the weight of that heavy bucket in your arm. Your left arm is becoming heavier, heavier, heavier by the second. You can feel the weight of that bucket in your fingers and your wrists and your elbows right up to your shoulder as the weight of that bucket pulls your left arm even further down. As your left arm pulls down, moves down, travels down, moving, pulling, traveling deeper, deeper, deeper into hypnosis. Your whole body is so heavy, your eyes are heavy. But in this right arm, 
you're holding a huge helium filled balloon, which is bigger than you, lighter than air, so weightless it feels like your right arm is attached to a pulley. And your right arm, all of its own, is floating up, moving up, lifting up, traveling up, floating up, moving up, lifting, traveling up. And as your right arm floats up, you're floating way deeper into hypnosis. As your right arm, floats up, you're moving deeper, deeper, deeper into hypnosis as your right arm travels up higher, 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 traveling even deeper into the most powerful, profound, healing, wonderful level of hypnosis. Your right arm is going to continue to move up even higher and you're aware one arm is weightless and one arm is weighed down because you are deeply suggestible. So much so that you're going to notice now that if you even try to push this arm down, it's like trying to push a balloon underwater. It simply insists on traveling up higher, higher. Try to push your right arm down and find it so weightless, the harder you try, the more it insists on floating up, traveling up, moving up. Meanwhile, try to raise your left arm and notice it feels like someone has just encased it in concrete. The harder you try to lift it, the more impossibly heavy it feels. One arm is weightless, one arm is weighed down because you're deeply suggestible. When you can accept stuff about magnets and balloons, you think, wow, if I'm accepting that, I'm going to accept it. When you tell me that I'm going to be the most amazing hypnotist, I'm going to be so successful. And as I click my fingers, you now have complete looseness in your arms. This is indicative of how completely you've let go. Now I'm going to tell you that your eyes are glued shut, fused shut, locked together, fused tightly together, so much so that the harder you try to open your eyes, the more they feel they're going to stick down, glue down, lock down, tighter, tighter, tighter. Try to open your eyes, but you find they're locked tight. Just try one more time to open your eyes and find they're all sealed together, glued together, and just stop trying now. That's right. I'm showing you at how good you are at accepting suggestions. Everyone is good at, at accepting suggestions. I'm showing you, you are good at suggesting suggestions, accepting suggestions. Let's do one more. Stretch your arms out, put your hands together. And now bring them 10 inches apart. And I'm going to tell you that there's two powerful magnets, one on each hand, and you can feel those magnets pulling your arms in, pulling them together, that mag that, those magnets pulling together, pulling, pulling, pulling. You stretch your arms out, you picture those two magnets right now. The one you can feel pulling the force of the other, the current of those magnets pulling your arms together. The closer your arms get, the stronger the pull is. The harder you try to resist it, the more forceful, the more powerful those magnets are, the more irresistible it is. That's right. And as you touch, you go deeper, deeper. Let your hands fall down to your lap. That's right. Now, in this state, you are so suggestible. So what I am telling you is that you are going to be the most amazing hypnotist, the most successful hypnotist. Just let yourself go to your wonderful subconscious to help you put all the resources in place that you need to get the results you seek the results that you deserve, the results you are working towards. You can ask your powerful subconscious to help you with, this re with these resources that you already have to become the most amazing, worldwide, fantastic, renowned hypnotist to get all the things you seek for your better self, your better life. Now, I want you to open your eyes, but look down and to your left. 
Open your eyes, that's right, and look down and to your left. I want you to slightly part your teeth so the upper and lower jaws don't touch. Now, you can feel the chair beneath you. You know we are here together. You are aware of your own breathing. You can hear the sound of my voice. Your feet are in contact with the floor. You can notice your clothing touching your skin. You can suddenly become aware of your tongue touching your teeth. And as you can be aware of my voice, and as you feel the chair supporting you, you can drift deeper and deeper into trance. Wow. Chris, I want you to imagine there's a yardstick that you're holding out in front of you. The bottom of the stick is touching the floor and the top of the stick is in your hand. And you can see a plastic markers along the stick from one at the bottom to 10 at the top. 10 represents a very light state of hypnosis and one represents a very deep sense of hypnosis. Now I want you to take your hand and move the bright plastic marker to the numbers that represents your state of hypnosis. Where 10 is really a light trance and one is the deepest trance that you can get. And when you have done that, please nod your head and tell me the number you have rested on. Six. Thank you. And now I want to ask your amazing, wonderful subconscious mind to understand that there's a deeper level. It knows there's a deeper level and I want your wonderful uh, unconscious subconscious mind to take you even deeper now. Now I want you to touch the tip of your tongue lightly behind your upper front teeth now. And now I want you to open your eyes, keep your chin down and look down to your right. And I want you to identify something that you want to improve. I want you to experience it and feel it as you look down and to your right. Now I want you to close your eyes over the next few moments as you continue to listen. I want you to notice that particular sensation that you notice now. What is that sensation you can feel now? Motivation. Where is that sensation? In my chest. Is it warm? Is it moving or is it intensifying or are you more aware of it now? More aware. More. more aware. You can notice too as you focus on it how easy it is to go deeper now. That's right, just go deeper down more deeply into a comfortable trance and enjoy letting go of anything that is not good for you now. You work so hard at what you do and you're learning every day. I mean really learning how you can get better and better being an amazing a hypnotist, the most powerful style you want to, to use. You can turn your brain into power mode. 
to get exactly where you want to be. That's right. Feel fine, feel fine. Enjoy, enjoy that trance. Good things will come. As your learning patterns, your motivation is intensifying and everything you need is falling effortlessly into place. Give me a little nod when you have all those resources tuned up to where they should be. And you're learning, I mean really learning, how hypnosis can really help you get the better life you deserve. A wonderful place that you want to be. New ideas, new ways to move forward, to take you forward to your future happiness and success. And to release any whole old habits that you don't want to, to hold on to anymore. Your conscious mind knows all the details and your unconscious mind knows the whole picture. And your conscious mind likes words. And your unconscious mind likes music. And your conscious mind likes sequence. And your unconscious mind takes in everything at once. And your conscious mind is interested in numbers. And your unconscious mind is focused on colour and shape. And your conscious mind keeps track of seven bits of information per second. And your unconscious mind keeps track of millions of things at once. And your conscious mind thinks it's in control. And your unconscious mind is in control. And your conscious mind has a narrow focus. And your unconscious mind sees everything. And I don't know exactly how quickly you are going to come out of trance. And you'll only awaken as slowly as your brain makes all the necessary changes. And I wonder, Chris, how quickly you'll notice that you are metamorphosizing into a successful hypnotist, the one you've always wanted to be. Quickly, easily, successfully. And you really see the value of the session we have done today and how it will help you make changes and how it will take you to a much happier place. And now I'm going to count, start counting from one to five to bring you back to full conscious awareness. One, beginning to emerge from hypnosis now, starting your journey back from hypnosis to full conscious awareness. Every nerve, every muscle feels good. And so you've taken a very pleasant hypnotic nap. Two, you feel wonderfully good, slowly, calmly, become more and more aware of where you are. Three, you, whenever you feel those negative things, you can just banish them and know that your future is benevolent and good. Four, 
beginning to stretch your muscles if you wish. Allow wonderful rejuvenating energy flow through you and five, open your eyes, take a deep breath in and feel good in every way. <laughs> Hello, hi. Hello. <laughs> Was that a good journey? Yeah. <laughs> Were you happy with the resolution you got there? Yeah. <laughs> Okay, well, that's just one of the ways that we will work with a client. Um, so it went through suggestibility tests to, to positive affirmations and hypnotic suggestions. And there was quite a few techniques I used there. So, Chris, thank you so much for letting me do that today. And um, you. <laughs> you look well, a bit late. I know for the next 10, 20 minutes. I hear you. <laughs> Never mind. Have a nice cup of tea. Okay, bye, everyone. I will see you, you again. And bye -bye. some more wonderful hypnotic work with you.